Museum and its wonderful garden. Well, I think this fantastic garden for, for several reasons. Uh, one is uh, Beatrice Potter is, is, is part of our culture. It's part of our, you know, it goes into our poetry, our art, as does gardening. That's one reason. The also second reason is I know that children will come here and engage in this, and uh, we're on a bit of a march with horticulture and children and, and getting them to think about where things come from, and this is obviously a big asset to that. I think the garden looks great now. It's, uh, it's really, it's every illustration, garden illustration that Beatrix Potter made has been brought to real life. When the first place actually I studied Beatrix Potter's illustrations, I looked to see what was actually growing and because she's such a fantastic illustrator, I was able to find out that something was a cos lettuce and then what I did was I tracked down what varieties of lettuce were growing at that time. Thank you. 